Hi guys, welcome to Mental Classroom. Today our topic is problems on train. So before we move on to the problems, let's discuss about some important concepts which will help you to solve the problems. So the first point is when a train crosses a pole, a standing man, tree, or any other object of negligible length, it crosses its own length. Let's see how. Suppose this is our train. And here is a man who is standing. Now the train is approaching towards this man. Now the train starts crossing the man. And at this point of time, the train finally crosses the man. So from this pictorial representation, it is clear that when a train passes this man, the train crosses its own length. Okay? So remember this guy. And if in place of this man, let us suppose be a platform. This is our train. And this is our platform. Similarly, the train approaches towards platform. At this point of time, the train starts crossing the platform. And finally, at this point, the train crosses the platform. So, the distance covered by train is from here to here. So, this length is the length of platform plus the length of train as you can see from this picture. So, remember guys, these two important formula that when a train crosses a pole, a standing man, tree or any other object of negligible length, it crosses its own length and when it crosses a platform which has some length. It crosses the length of platform plus the length of train. So guys, our first problem is a train 280 meter long running with a speed of 63 km per hour will pass a tree in what time? So as we have discussed, when a train passes a tree, man, or any other object of negligible length, it crosses its own length. So, our distance here is 280 meter and our speed here is 63 kilometer per hour. So, you can see, we, we, can, we have to convert this kilometer per hour into meter per second for which we have to multiply it by 5 by 18. Okay, let's cut it, cancel by 3. 21, so our time will be 16 so let's move on to our next problem which is the length of the bridge which a train of 130 meter long traveling at 45 km per hour can cross in 30 seconds is what? means we have to find the length of the bridge okay now as we know that when a train crosses a platform a bridge or any other object which has some length then it crosses its own length plus the length of the object in this case that object is bridge so to solve this problem let us assume the length of the bridge be L let the length of the bridge B 
the L-meter. So, the train crosses a distance of L plus 130 meter at a speed of 45 kilometer per hour. Now we have to convert this 45 kilometer per hour into meter per second, which is 45 multiplied by 5 by 80. Now we will apply this equation. It's equal to our the time in which the train crosses is 30 seconds. So our time. If we calculate this, we get the length of L as 245 meter, which is our answer.